will not relent in the war against corruption. The president emphasized that no effort will be spared in ensuring that the vice that has been choking the country's economy is completely destroyed. Here is Chris Sambu with the details. While speaking at State House when he separately bid farewell to outgoing European Union delegation, Ambassador Stefano De Jack and British High Commissioner Nick Haley, President Uru Kenyatta broke the silence, saying that the government is focused on the fight against corruption. In his address, the president said, and I quote, We'll remain focused in the fight against corruption. We hope that every institution will play its part to make this war successful. Ambassador Dijak and I Commissioner Haley separately praised President Kenyatta for standing firm in the war against corruption. The outgoing European Union envoy encouraged President Kenyatta not to lose his grip in the fight against draft. On his part, Ambassador Dijak said, and I quote, The war against corruption in Kenya is restoring investors' confidence. The European Union will remain a strategic partner of Kenya not only on the economic front, but in the fight against corruption. The recent war on corruption has seen senior government officials arrested including National Treasury Cabinet Secretary Eni Rotit and his permanent secretary Kamau Dhuge. The president, however, appointed Ukuri Etani as the acting cabinet secretary after the two were arraigned in court on corruption allegations. Chris Sambu, KUTV.